Hello everyone, it's Lindsay, and today I have another unboxing video on my channel for you guys. This is the April kit from By the Well for God. This is Fruit of the Spirit. Uh, this is a kit that they produce in-house at By the Well for God, and so I will link it down below for you guys. And it is still on pre-sale, which means I get to show you the bonus extra goodies that you can pick up as part of the pre-sale. So let me show you what comes in the kit first. Uh, everything comes in this canvas drawstring bag. I just pulled some of the extra goodies out um, for the sake of filming, but everything comes in the package here. And let's start with the devotional content. Uh, Lori at By the Well for God really prides herself on having good devotional content in her kits. Her kits are always cute and super full of awesome goodies to play with, but her devotional content is just amazing. I have loved every kit that I've worked through, and I don't think this one's going to be any different. So this is Fruit of the Spirit, and we, of course, are diving into the Fruits of the Spirit. But I want to uh, read to you what she says on her um, site. So never mind that my phone screen is cracked. But she says, um, but what comes to mind when you read these verses? And that's Galatians 5, through 23, where we're talking about the fruits of the Spirit. She says, do you truly dwell on the meaning of what Paul wrote? Or do you picture grapes, apples, and oranges adorning your casual dinnerware? Sometimes it's easy to be too shallow in our thinking and use verses like this as inspiration for decoration without reflecting on the message that Paul is delivering. Use this devotional study as you prepare to take hold of the promised land of the fruit of the Spirit and dig into the meaning behind the fruits. So I love that she is really pushing us to really focus on what those verses mean and not just they are cute and fun to journal but she's got the cute and fun taken care of so it is a 14 day devotional and the way her devotionals are typically set up are um, a day of reading and reflecting on the devotional content and then spending the next day creating in your Bible. So you would get a total of 28 days uh, to work through a devotional, but of course you can change that up and do whatever works for you. Uh, I end up usually sitting down and doing several entries at once. That's just what works with my schedule. So there's the devotional content. It is in traveler's notebook size. So if you wanted to keep it in a like traveler's notebook cover, uh, she does have some new ones available on her site. This isn't one of them. Um, mine is in the mail, <laughs> but she does have some new Webster's Pages devotional cover or um, traveler's notebook covers and these fit in these covers. So you can check that out. I will link them down below. So you get the devotional, you get uh, some clear stickers. So you get three sheets of clear stickers and they all have these really fun uh, kind of geometric or little wonky fruits in the little toucan. Um, this one here is gonna be the fruits of the spirit word, words, and then some fun little bits on there as well. And then you get some faux washi strips. So this is not real washi tape, so you can't tear it, um, but you can cut into it, and it's just different prints and things that match the uh, kit. Super cute, so you've got those. You get the stamp set and it's those wonky fruits and they've got the fruits of the spirit written on there. So patience, gentleness, self-control. Um, of course, you could ink these up to where you're not inking up the words and just stamp the fruit also if you wanted to do that. So those are so cute. I cannot wait to play with those. And uh, I'll go ahead and show you the paints because I think these would be great for painting in your stamped images. So her kits include a little Daniel Smith uh, swatch card. So it is little blobs of paint. I've acti mine, activated mine so you can see the colors so bright and fun. Um, and what these are, just little samples of Daniel Smith watercolors that you can use as you work through your kit and just get a feel for what high quality watercolors are like and maybe find some colors that you want to uh, purchase the individual tubes of. Um, these colors, this thalo blue is just so rich and deep. I mean, they are just amazing. If you have not played with good quality watercolors, these are a great way to try them out. So you can use these to color in your stamped images and that kind of thing. You get uh, three uh, tip-ins or bookmarks, however you want to use them. And hers are front and back. So you've got designs and verses on the front. And then the back side has some little details and verses as well. So you can adhere these directly down into the margin of your Bible or use them as a tip-in, however you want to use those. And there is room for journaling. So you get three of those. 
You get a set of cardstock stickers and it's in this fun, it totally reminds me of the 90s, like neon colors and the little like zigzags and things, but they are a full set of alphabet uh, stickers with multiples of each letter. So you can use those in your journaling. So you've got that. You get the fabric bow clips in fabrics that correspond with the kit. And then the title of the kit, of course, is Fruit of the Spirit with the Galatians verse on the back there. So you could use this um, to gift to somebody, stick it in your car, stick it on your mirror, use it as a tip-in, however you want to use that little verse card there. You get two little pieces of flair, Rejoice Always and Take the Promised Land. These are so cute little pins. So they are little buttons. I like to attach mine to my fabric clippies, but you could attach them to the front of your Bible if you've got a Bible cover that's fabric or your um, bag that you carry your supplies in or a backpack or something like that. So there's lots of different ways you can use those. And then you get die cut pieces. These are so cute. So I keep mine all in one of these little uh, containers that I get from Michael's. But here's a look at everything. And they are printed and cut all in-house. So the amount of work that she puts into these is just phenomenal. Look at the little orange slices, tabs. I like to cut these tabs in half. And so then I get double uh, the tabs that I can use there. I love that she includes uh, all kinds of different sizes and shapes of tabs and die cuts. So this really fun tropical theme to this kit this month. So, so cute. It has us totally getting ready for summer. And that bowl of fruit. So you'll notice these are in the stamps and the stickers. So maybe you're somebody who just wants to use die cuts and not the others. You've got it covered or, you know, however, whatever medium or just use all the things like I do. The little kiwis are super cute. And then there's some smaller pieces also. More tabs, that little flamingo little ladybug, more tabs, and then this would be a great title starter, Fruit of the Spirit, and then two little mini doilies. How cute is that? I love playing with these. It'd be fun to layer behind things on your page um, and create some little layered groupings there. So there's a look at everything that comes in the kit. I believe she will have um, color swatching over on her Instagram if you wanna check that out. I will look and I'll try to get it on a blog post if I can, um, different markers and things that will match this kit. So that is everything that comes in the kit and it is pre-sale. So if you order during the pre-sale, you have the opportunity to pick up some extra stamp sets for a reduced cost, depending on how many stamp sets you add to your order. Um, they are normally $15 a set, but you can get them as low as $10 a set, depending upon how many you add to your order. So you've got Fishers of Men is an option. Look at these fish, how cute. She's got like a little rose in her uh, fish hair. <laughs> so cute. And this would be a fun uh, texture to add to backgrounds. Uh, the fruits, so you've got that toucan, that really awesome tropical leaf and flower, and then of course the words that are the fruit of the spirit. This would be a great one to pair with this kit. And then the promised land, so you've got um, some more birds, some more greenery, um, and then some more statement uh, pieces. So I will be using all of these as a journal uh, through this kit, and you can pick these up as well as several other options. Um, if you look at the last photo in the listing, that is your options for your stamp set. So. And then if you order, and I think over $35 worth of product, including this kit, so this kit, plus whatever you wanna to add to your order for $35 or over, you get a bonus package of goodies. This isn't exactly what you'll get, but it's something similar to this. So you'll get a little mini stamp set, some fabric clippies, and then usually some die cuts or stickers. These look like clear stickers. So it will be a little bit different what you get with this particular kit. This was just an example of um, one of the sets that she has. So you get little bonus goodies and she's always just so generous. She's got some extra um, alpha stickers in corresponding colors. I am gonna order those. And they are the tile alphas and translucent sticker alphas that will correspond with the kit also. So I'll link those down below for you guys. So there is a look at everything that comes in the kit as well as the extra bonus goodies you can get. Uh, let me know down in the comments 
below if you're gonna be picking up this kit and journaling along with me. I will have videos throughout the month as I work through processes. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. And until next time, thank you so much. Bye-bye.